Hey guys, I'm back. It has been two long weeks and I am in Tennessee. I love Tennessee for two reasons. One, to work on my property and two, to go to the grocery outlet store because it's so much closer when I'm already here. And this week I actually found some deals. Well, at least they were deals to me. And inside we go. Oh, you can't miss this display. This is really good. It's my daughter's favorite popcorn. Boom Chicka Pop. It's huge. Where's the price? Where's the price? Where's the price? $4.99. That's really good. This is something I like all year round, even when it's not Thanksgiving, because there are a couple of dishes that I like to make. Um, it's the foil packet meal. It's really good. But these are $2.19. That's a little high for me. Velveeta mac and cheese. These prices are feeling a little bit normal today, so I'm not sure if we're going to see any really good deals or not, but these are $2.49. Oh, no, nuts are a good deal. <gasps> oh, they're not nuts. Wait a minute. These are Holiday Nut Crunch. Oh, my goodness. $2.99. Okay, so I'm not sure that I want the spice mix, but that looks really good. I do want to get some of these. I do love the nuts. Guys, while I'm doing this, I also want to thank everybody who watches my channel and hangs out with me. Um, those of you from everyone who just watches like these kind of things like where we shop for super cheap but thank you for watching for supporting me for commenting for liking all those other great things I especially like to see when I see people from UK from Canada from it's really cool the Philippines even watch that's like you don't ever imagine anything like that ever happening so thank you very much okay, so we're looking before I load up on one thing that I'm not sure I'm gonna like we're actually going to do one of each. Okay, so we're just strolling through. Oh, they have spam for the spam lovers. Eleven twenty nine for how many in a pack? Four 12 ounce cans. That's expensive, isn't it? Is spam that expensive? I didn't know there's such thing as maybe. Well, they have all kinds of spam. I didn't know that. I do watch YouTube. Oh, wait, what's this? Tangy and fiery mango. One dollar mayo i don't think i want i like just plain mayo never mind oh <gasps> they have craft hold on craft for 149 as you guys know we've been doing a lot of lunches so i can do <gasps> look at this here's the deal sandwich bread i do remember that i do like that so i'm gonna get some i don't like the orange sandwich sandwich bread i do like these here babe we got two of these two yeah we're gonna get two of those these are 50 cents you know what two here we put these in we're just gonna get two of those. I got hot. I have hot dogs. Do you like hot dogs? Mm -hmm. you like hot dogs with coleslaw or with sauerkraut or ketchup and mustard? Okay. Let's check out the display. Valentine's Day brownie bites. Ooh, dangerous. A dollar ninety nine. These are kind of interesting. I never pictured these as being authentic or anything, but they look quite convenient. That's cute. You just stuff the pocket. No mess. A tortillas for. How much? Dollar forty-nine. And cherry beans. You want some? I don't know that I like them. Sixty-nine cents. Well, they don't have sweet pickles here, but I have to stop and check. <gasps> they have whole sweet pickles here. They're two dollars and fifty cents. Oh my goodness! I think we can get the Walmart brand cheaper. They also have sweet relish, two fifty-nine. I'm betting Mama Fresca is probably pretty good. But I don't want to pay that price just yet. Here's a sweet relish I can deal with. Look, one dollar. Life sweet relish. One dollar. So I am going to get, I do like these. Um, let me check the date to see if I'm okay with paying them. A dollar for this. Okay, I'm okay with paying a dollar. Yeah, thank you. Okay. How much are the raw olives? I think I stocked up on olives a while ago when they had them for a dollar. It was pretty exciting. These are $2.10. Okay. I'm not sure. I think these are still about the same price as um, Sam's Club, actually. These are $10.98 separately. The double pack is how much? $10.98. Really? That's creamy. That's what I'm saying. Oh, it is? Okay, good. Yeah, I can be. I like the creamy. That's good. Yeah. There you go. Don't need a membership for that, do you? Almost forgot, have to check out the meat section. Oh, it's not quite as pretty this week. There's not quite as much of it either. Okay, so, two steaks, ribeye, $11.11, .11. huh, $7.99 a pound. 
Let's check out this one. $25.47. That's $9.99 a pound. I am trying to dig this out because I want to see what these huge butter round roasts look like. They are $22.98. And it really is huge. I'm not going to pick that up. That's kind of flimsy. $5.99 a pound. I don't see a lot of fat. That's probably a decent deal. I'm looking for a special on Cindy Specials. And you guys know they always have the deals on meat on Tuesdays. Well, I'm not here on Tuesdays, so... $17.72 while I'm here for family pack. All right. Today's special here we are. So a sliced lunch deli meat. What kind is it? It's turkey breast. $3.99. Hmm. It's $2.49 a pound. It's not very heavy. You guys know I'm drawn to cases of stuff. So a case of Spare ribs, 10 pounds, is $11.90. It's drawn to the meat these days. Oh, we have tenderloins. They're not beef tenderloins, but honey mustard pork tenderloin, $4.09. This is a regular pork tenderloin. How much is that? $8.43. Oh, yeah. They have got out the pork chops today, the huge family packs. Now, I still swear they are cutting these so much thinner. They're slicing them so much thinner. But the packs are back to the regular sizes. So this huge pack is $19.97. You see, pork ribs, pork ribs. Um, so this is $17.85. I come to here see if we can find some chicken breast. <gasps> we do have chicken breast, and this time it's not the two pack. So we've got a regular size pack of chicken breast for $9.77, $2.19 a pound. That's more like what we're living in. That's better. The thighs are $9.79, a pound. And what are you looking at? The legs? How much are those? I can't see the price. Uh, $4.60. And we're turning back around to go down this one. Let's check out the price of the yams. $0.79. Cents. Well, someone just left this on the perfect display, all tilted up and everything. Pinto beans, a dollar. Oh my goodness, a dollar forty-nine for this ginormous can. That is really good. Uh, pink sticker, pink sticker. Apricot halves were $1.99. They're now $1.08. And this is a pretty good size can. It's 29.10 ounces. Oh, it's $1, not $1.09. That's that handy, dancy, fancy handwriting somebody's got. I wonder if all of their large cans are super... <gasps> Sweet peas, $1.29. Again, a huge can. This is two pounds. He's picking out fruit. What kind are we picking out? Pineapple. How much is the pineapple? $1.19. $1.19. It's a deal, $1.99. Oh, coleslaw dressing. I have been getting a lot of coleslaw lately, and I don't have any of this. Can you imagine? None of this in my pantry. I need a case of... Ooh. Be right back. Now we're back after we've put everything back nice and neatly. Sorry about that. Just give me a whole one. And you know what? I'm going to get one for my brother, too. He loves coleslaw. So, um, this one behind it. We're getting the coleslaw for free, so I think this, the coleslaw salad dressing is fine. Yeah, is it coleslaw? Yeah. Yep. We're getting those. Can you check all of them? Egg rolls. We're talking about the cabbage. I can make egg rolls with that when I get those five pound bags of it, but I don't always feel like making egg rolls. We're checking out the beans and see what types of meat they have over here. I've passed the meat. Okay, corned beef. You guys know I'm a sucker for corned beef. $11.99. Okay, nope, that's a regular price. I'm going to pass on that. These are $3.49 a can. See, chicken. $1.99 for a little can. Where's that sliced luncheon meat? That are, here it is. Okay, so it's the equivalent, I think, to spam. $2.39. They have stout beef chili, ground beef, pinto, and kidney beans. Oh, it's the whole chili made and it's stout. Let's see. You know what? It's not moving in the can. It is quite thick. Sticker, a sticker, a sticker. Sloppy Joe sauce, 33 cents per can. Okay, so I was looking at this. And the reason it's 33 cents is it's past date, which is fine. So it's November of 2023, which is why they're 33 cents. We're back at the rice. Is it holding? It is. It's 169 for two pounds of rice and let's check out the beans 
Jack Rabbit's beans. Three dollars and ninety nine cents for four pounds. Hormel chili. Oh, hormel chili with beans. Well, that's good. Okay, so this is what we've got so far going on, and I just came across. Look, they've actually started nicely marking these. The clearance, clearance, clearance section. How much is that coffee? Five ninety nine. What's the even? Even. $5.99. Sweetener's been marked down to two. No, three. $3.99. Corn tamale. 79 cents. Of course, the spicy mayo. We saw that coming in. Now just one dollar. Pete's cereal bars. Where the oh, they're down here. Oh, it looks like a rice crispy. These are 25 cents. They used to be 50. Check out the canned goods. These are, ah, Bush's Pinto Beans. My mom loves these. They have been marked down to $1. I was about to make a phone call until I flipped it and saw with jalapenos, there's no way. So I'm gonna leave these for someone else. And this is a canner's dream. Mrs. Wages Hot Salsa Seasoning Mix, $1. All right, and we're just gonna take those. There were three, but we'll grab those. That's okay, thank you. Distracted. Had you distracted. Oh, I was looking at that. I didn't know what it was. Oh, oh, I like that. It's a pocket wine corkscrew. I guess in case you forget yours at home. Huh. Guys, my cornflakes were so good. And they're still $3.99. And these go through May. Okay, so are you going to pick out a cereal this time? If they had Captain Crunch, I'd get Captain Crunch. Okay. Let's see. Frosted Flakes, $4.49. Rice Krispies, $3.99. Lucky Charms, $3.49. That's a really small box. Life Cereal, that's pretty good. $3.49, no, $3.69. Fruit Loops, $3.99. That's not bad. That is a huge, huge, huge box. That's, I can't even tell you how big it is. It's just, it's big to run over here and check. I thought I had every seasoning there is. I need time. Ha, huh, I need time. I need time. I'm gonna see if I can find some. I am gonna pick up another two rosemaries. These are still a dollar because I do love getting the tomatoes and doing the rosemary roasted tomatoes. Did you like those on your sandwich? Add a little flavor, didn't it? A little something? Yeah. Okay. Just right? Okay. Down time. Okay. I want all of those. Yes. I think there's only five. Oh, no. Just one, the half the cart. Not, no, not whole. I'm, yeah. I know. I messed this up on that. Just this one. We'll just take these. And we'll just make sure. I know it's hard shopping with me in it because I like, <laughs> I, he's not used to bulk buying. So <laughs> with me, anything less than a full slab or a full slat or a full case is like no, not right. I'm going to make sure these are all the same. This is when you throw variables in. I know, See, that's right? That's seven. true. That's a seven. It is. It is. It's not half. It's not a full. Wait, how many's in a full? I'm not going to eat all this before it goes bad. You know what? You're right. Take one back. I'll get half. That's six. Good job. <laughs> Wait, I think I see seasoning packets. If we can find the packets for coleslaw, I mean, I can make it. I don't want to. Then we can put the others back. You need to check out the syrup. I'm getting kind of low on that really? because, oh, Elf, <gasps> Mrs. Butterworth, because it's Christmas, flip it. How much is it? It might be cheaper. Well, pick another one. That one said no. Well, they don't want to tell us the price at any of them. Are you serious? Really? There's not a single price. Okay. Um, picked up four. We're going to see how much those cost. Hey, wait, I'm going under your arm. Right here. Okay. They've moved the milk. Evaporated milk is $1.29. Count truck. I do remember Count Chocula, but I didn't eat them. They have cereal bars 20 for... Wait, the price is one, one back there. $3.49. Guys don't know. I like finding cases of items. I like finding super cheap items, like 10 cents, 15 cents. Apple Jack's cereal bars are one twenty nine, which that would be good, but it's a very small pack and it's extremely light. And there are only six in there. 
This is more like it because this one has five chewy granola bars, oats and honey. And guess what? They're 50 cents. So guys, oatmeal has just gone up so much. They used to be the thing we ate. We were very poor. I lived on a, lived on a farm, grew up on a farm. We had oatmeal every single morning or grits, which is probably why I'm more of a grit person now. Now this is a large canister, two pounds, $4.19. Sweet yellow cornbread mix, 79 cents a pack. Seven sure for $6.99. How many is in here? Four as standard. What were we in? Okay, stop. Last time I passed up the mint tea because I said I didn't want to. I am going to get it now. I went home and reevaluated. I am low on my mint tea. That's $5.99. It's the date. The prices are different because of the date. That's closer to it expiration but coffee doesn't really expire so we don't care i'm gonna get some tea will you count out 10 since you're right there peppermint third row right yes okay, rethinking this this is natural green tea with peppermint flavor i'm gonna put this back coffee aisle looks a little bit better this time let's see what we've got going on um, this is still tea, but I think these are, no, these are bags, not K-cups. $1.19. French roast and hazelnut, four forty nine. What is this? It is. is little packets. Bag? Um, these are K-cups. Eight nineteen. What it happened to the two twenty nines? Sanka, somebody was talking about that. Do you remember that from back in the day that used to be the coffee? Yeah. Everybody's drinking Sanka. Remember the commercials? That, that, I, I Sanka remember. in your cup. Yeah. Remember that? Yeah. 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 So, a <laughs> dollar ninety nine. Wow, that's been years and years and years. I didn't know they still made that. Got Dunkin' Cold Coffee six ninety nine. The K cups are five ninety nine. I'm looking for the plain, just simple. Guess they won't have any more $2.99 for a long time. Sunken is $11.99 for two K cups. Ooh, I have coffee. $3.99. Buttery syrup. Oh, stop it. Okay, maybe better if you're into IHOP. <laughs> IHOP chocolate chip. $3.99. And we are approaching a pink a sticker and a yellow sticker. I think we saw these last time. Yeah, over in some section. Coco, $3.99 for the little K-Cups. What'd you get that you're hiding? Uh -huh, oh, hiding. toothpick thingies. Yeah. Okay, yeah, those I've are been, good. I've been meaning That's to good. get some, so I never think about it. Birthday cake mix. What's two forty nine now one forty nine. I'm not sure I understand what this is. Because it's a very small... Oh, it's a beverage. Got it. Hey, sugar. Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> Thank you, honey. <laughs> Back over here. I do want to get some more of those Ziploc bags because they turn out to be cheaper than they were at Dollar Tree. I'll find them. For seal. Okay, there's a freezer. I have really good freezer ones still. Actually, you know what? Still just get me. Those are 119. Get me two of those for an emergency. Yes, and I'm going to get two of these for an emergency. These are just the regular sandwich ones. I probably won't do much freezing with these. And if I do, it'll be for maybe a week or so. But they are, I didn't tell you the price today, $1.79 and there's 50. So checking this out, 54 quart freezer bags, $2.99. They are. Are they? They are, 54 for $2.99. To another section. All the bags are gone, $1.99, done, done, done. Let's see, are these sold in cases? Could I be in luck? Okay, no. These are cocktail sausages, the little weenie thingies. And these are $1.99 each. Lunch and meats, that's pretty good. $2.99. Actually, I think that's pretty standard. What do we have here? Ham. Ham is $1.99, and that's not very much of it. Bacon in an unusual format. Oh, it's upside down. Oh, it's what? It's doubled. Are they trying to pull a Sam's? Okay, so turkey bacon is $3.99. Now here's a large luncheon meat. They had this during the storm for $3.49. This looks pretty fresh up here. What is this? Ah, oh, delicatessen, 
fresh slice, two forty nine. I'm gonna skip this aisle for now and go down because I'm looking in the freezer section. And I'm hoping to find something good. Oh wait, wait, wait. I see Reese's. My brother loves Reese's, so I'm gonna see what they have. It's a dollar forty nine for what are these cookie dough poppers? I don't think he's gonna want those though. Real Velveeta, four forty nine for the small box. That's still so expensive. Is that even real cheese? It's good, but it's not even real cheese. Wait, what was that? That looked turkey or chicken? Well, yeah, but are they? Oh, they're pork. Okay, one twenty nine. That's actually a really good deal. That's a very good deal. Here is where we usually find some really cool stuff. Okay, so bacon three ninety nine. Bacon was two ninety nine, now one ninety nine, and it's turkey bacon. Oh, so that was three ninety nine too. It was marked down to two ninety nine. That's good. I kind of like this bargain bin thing going on. Thin cut what? I'm not really sure. Six fourteen. Looks like very thin sliced beef. It says peppered a dollar ninety nine. You know what? I will do a dollar ninety nine because the last time I came and showed you guys there, they were still two twenty nine, and they still haven't marked them all down. But I will do a dollar ninety nine. I'm excited about these, so I'm gonna put some of these in the cart. Oh, my hands are so cold. That's a good deal. And on the side, they have, of course, they always have French fries. Now these are name brand. Arida, two ninety nine. Onion rings, five ninety nine. Popcorn chicken, $2.99. Yeah, the meatballs, Italian style, $6.49. Feels like those have gone up a little bit for some reason. Okay, guys, so remember we came last time we got these for 20 cents, the vegetarian meatballs. They were very, very good. They're still 20 cents, and they still have quite a few left. And like I said, as long as you don't expect a meatball, they were really good. I used to buy these for the kids all the time because it was a quick snack. And they could just put them in the oven themselves. I'm talking as early as like seven, eight, nine. I was anything they could do on their own. Five ninety nine. Something in a pouch. This looks grilled cheese. Really, they're selling me a grilled cheese sandwich for a dollar. Okay. You know what? If you can do it, do it. I see a case. I see a case. I see a case. Okay. They're still here. The chicken breast fritters. And this is what they look like. Someone's opened one. They look pretty good, but most of it looks like breading, so you probably wouldn't get very much meat. I don't remember seeing a whole lot of sides here. I do remember vegetables, but they're further down that way. These are mashed potatoes for $1.99. Oh, these are so good. Mozzarella sticks. I've got to learn how to make those. I have a roll of mozzarella cheese, and I want to make my own. I think I can find that on YouTube. These are $6.99, a price I really don't want to pay, but they are so good. Yes, and we are back in vegetables, so. Ooh, 79 cents for corn. Cauliflower ranch with bacon. Huh. $1.99. That's that one and that one. Regular vegetables should still be a dollar. I can't find a price. There we are. One dollar. Other vegetables, one dollar. Cut leaf spinach. One dollar. Ooh, weekly special. Wise Pies Pizza, two dollars and ninety-nine cents. They're all pepperoni. So we are here. Lots of shrimp. Oh, this is a different type book kind of thing. What is this? I need to flip it so I can read it. Beef neck bones. We're going down, and I think I saw. I do see rabbit, but first look, guys. <gasps> Frog legs, full of flavor. So they have those and I'm looking for, well, he's there. I'll walk around. Okay. He moved on down. All right. So look, oh, and this looks first. $14 and 98 cents for a rabbit. That's five ninety nine dollars a pound. Checking out the fruit. This looks really good. These are, okay. It's a berry blend. $1 raspberries. Are they $1 too? They are, they're one dollar. One bag of strawberries, just one dollar. These look so good. What are they? Oh, Irish cream and vanilla flavored donut holes. Three dollars and 99 cents. Author cakes and pies. Are they still, oh, that's four ninety nine. I think they're going up a little bit. So let's see how much these are per 
case. I gotta find a price. Okay, so I found it. Six bowls, $4.99. Four Jack's pizzas. Again, something like you'd buy from Sam's. These are cheese. I do like starting with cheese pizzas. I kinda like doing my own. $8.99. Guys, bread has gotten so stinking expensive. All right, what are these toaster pop-ups? Are these breakfast ones? Breakfast, they are. Look, how much are they? $3.99. I do see the Jimmy Dean Canadian egg and bacon. I'm going to do more of these because again, I don't have many breakfasts. $3.99. You guys know I made some breakfast bowls. Well, they never, never even made it to the freezer. I ate them all. Never even made any breakfast burritos. Ate them all, pretty good. What, you got to get those and let them turn yellow, then refrigerate them? Yep. Yeah. Because if yeah, they get too cold, they won't turn yellow. Okay. Let's see. Oh, my goodness. It looks like somebody was making... Oh, somebody decided to put their rabbit back. No, I don't refrigerate my bananas. He refrigerates them. He says they stay fresh on the inside. Chicken breast, $1.49. That's kind of high. Chip, I forgot to check out the cheese over here. So, Velveeta Slice is $2.99. That's actually decent. I have cheese cream cheese. Nothing as good as that one deal we got where there was a case of them for $4.99. These are $1.49. Silk coconut milk. $1.99. Okay, so when I followed that comment to buy these, these did turn out to be really, really, really good. They're amazing. Spicy guacamole. You guys see, I've been getting guacamole and freezing it myself, and it's been working out really well. These are $2.79, and I think you get four bowls. You do. Okay, I do not need milk, but I do need milk. Do they have a half gallon? Of course not. So, guess what? I will get a full gallon. It's actually a pretty good deal on avocados. Oh, my goodness. They are so soft. They're so... Okay, these are very firm. And... I don't want to do that in case somebody else wants to check it out. $0.59 cents each recognize this as the last aisle or the bread aisle sometimes we get really good things done here okay so they still have peanuts what kind are these the little packets four dollars and fifty cents cheddar cheese sandwich crackers a dollar ninety nine the peanut butter oh these are good i need some for my desk a dollar ninety nine i'll pass beef jerky always expensive 4.99 i've never made that with my dehydrator guys i'm just scared to i mean just dehydrating it really cook it at that low of a heat temperature these look good for $1.59. Oh, these look so good. I don't know if I'm gonna pay $1.59, but if I don't and I leave, I won't come back. And I wish I had. You know what, you live once and I work very hard. So, thank you, baby. I'm going to buy two. I got the popcorn. Oh, this was at the front. Oh no, this is actually cheaper. It's $1.49. Not bad. And this one is, I can't find a price, $1.99. It says, your true north is calling. I'm not sure what a true north is, so I'm checking it out. Ooh, cashew crunch. $1.99. Peanuts, $3.99. It's a very good thing that I don't need bread this week because guess what? It's about gone. But if I did need some, a large loaf of sandwich bread would be $1.99. Do we have any hamburger buns? We have hamburger buns, which would be $2.59. Let's see if I can find a hot dog bun anywhere. Anywhere at all. Nope. Oh, but I did come across the Hawaiian rolls, and these are so incredibly good. $2.79. Going down this aisle to see what's in here. Yes, he's looking for plates. Okay, so there's that. Let's see what kind of detergent they have. Just detergent. This has been here for a while. They're $1.29. I want to see something. You know what, it looks pretty thick. It doesn't look watery and cheap. So I'm not sure what it is. I'm not sure if I wanna try one. We do take them to work because we have to supply our own kitchen with certain things. So you know what? I'm gonna get two. Here, I'm gonna buy those for work. Looks like he's going for the eco. Are you going for the eco plates? Like really? Well, it's because it's the the depth. I don't really see anything else. How much are these again? Three forty nine for fifty. Three forty nine for fifty. It goes smart. And we were just talking about this because I put together the bunk bed 
and you need very good hex key set. They're a dollar. You know what? I'm picking up two. <laughs> one for home, one for the car, one for the truck, one for whatever, but I think that's totally worth it. One dollar is really good. Hey, snack. She likes these. $11.99. What is this? Oh, I've seen these before. Disposable charcoal tray. Turkey cheese. Well, oh, cheese. Okay, I was going to say, dogs can have cheese. What are these chickens? These are for $4.99. She's a big dog, so when I give her something, I want it to be good. She does have um, tartar, but we give her, mom gives her these. So, you know what? Actually, put these in the cart. These are a little bit cheaper. These are $8.99, guys. And my mom buy these for her, buys these for her. See how this compares to other places. Okay, so say you use a fabric softener. Um, $6.99 for Big Snuggle. Now, I know a lot of places buy one, get one free, and you can use a discount. Also, if you go to Dollar General, you can go on a Saturday and use that 5 off 25 coupon, which might make that a little bit cheaper. So, Purex is $3.99. Tide Simply, $9.99. What's the name? I like all. No, my daughter likes the all with the orange cap. $3.99. Oh my goodness, they already have oven roasted tomatoes. Give me a second. They're pouches. I kind of like doing my own, but how much are these? Because I can get a deal. Okay, so I've pulled out another one. There is not a price. There has to be a display somewhere with a price. Let me try the other side. They're more over there. And looking for a price. Still not really hump. I think they're just getting this stuff in because they haven't been able to market all just yet. You know what? Maybe it's for a reason. Maybe I don't need to know. I'll just keep doing my own. Here, I forgot. I need fajita. Ah, fajita seasoning. I can't believe I am out of that. I'm going to get two. I forgot how much these are. They were... Oh, i got to put them down. Let me check. Let me check. Let me check. Oh, there you are. Here. I'm getting, yeah, I needed the fajita seasoning and I forgot how much they cost. Weren't they like $4.99 for these? Here's a second one while I'm looking. Because I got the lemon pepper. Where are the prices, people? I don't like this. I'm slightly unnerved. Oh. He put them in the cart. I was like, where'd you put them? He's like, I hid them from you. There is not a single one marked. I'm looking through the camera. Nope, not a single one. That makes me, yeah. Fine. Because you know what? By the time I get up there, I do want it. I'm probably going to pay the price no matter what. All right, guys, we are heading to checkout. Okay, so the total came to $134.75. It's hard to focus. Tax on this was, hmm, I don't even know. There are a bunch of different taxes, but $134.75. I am so completely excited with all of us. Most of it's for me, some of it's to share. And some of it's just for storing and preserving other food that I get. So I'm very, very happy. I don't think I could go anywhere else and get things that I like and love. I mean, just really, really love for $135. Okay, guys. So that's it for us. Um, it's kind of nice to shop when you don't have. Let's go to the other side because she's on this side. It's really kind of nice to shop when you can afford the things that you buy. So I'm pretty excited. Till next time. Be happy, be healthy, most importantly, stay safe.